What's up guys? Welcome back to the Montyverse. We are here to check out Knuckles, the side series of one of the greatest cinematic experiences of our lifetime, Sonic the Hedgehog. Nikki, are you ready? I am ready, but I know that you're definitely ready. Oh, I'm so ready. I've missed the Sonic universe. I need to jump back into it head first, feet first, whatever you want to say. Let's do it. Oh boy. Jumping into Knuckles episode one right now. Oh, oh, oh yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Whoa. Oh, he made his own little camp. That's cool. Ugh. Whoa. So it, did they just carve all that out of trees? Yep. This is crazy because that whole sequence kind of felt like a side scroller. It did, yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. And, and who had the painting skills for that? Yep. Look at this is like very Rocky Four. It all began on the mushroom planet, where old nuts got tricked into helping the- Whoa. Whoa. Recap. Hey, wait a minute. <laughs> this is the wrong footage. Why are we showing it? <laughs> Sonic, never change, bud. Knuckles' only mission is to relax and enjoy <laughs> which might be harder than- That's perfectly encapsulates all three of them. Yes. Oh, that's- <laughs> That's cool. Oh, oh no! no! mean he didn't know he doesn't know how construction works Pitiful. oh <laughs> so badass oh god <laughs> what <laughs> what's going on what kind of job this is mrs wakowski oh um. no i missed this so much i missed it did you call us up to fix your house so you could Hunt us for sport? No, no, no. no. <laughs> Why, it might look like that, but one of our kids gets a little... Your kid did this. He's a <laughs> really big kid. With a <laughs> Always training, questing, as well as stalking, hunting, and terrorizing. <laughs> nice. You know yeah. how kids are at that age. I don't know if I'd well, say that. Oh, great. Ooh. <sighs> oh, boy. Oh, boy's right. Tortilla. No, no, that's a Dorito. Is it a Dorito or is it a to Tostito? I hope it's a Dorito. <laughs> oh, it's a Cool Ranch Dorito! I, I'm shocked you couldn't recognize it. <laughs> Why did I mark out for that? I hope to visit this Cool Ranch of Doritos and <laughs> all of it. Oh my god. Slender. Man, me and Knuckles, same. We vibe. I don't know if that's a good thing. We'd be friends. <laughs> Oh, oh my boy! Guys, that's the fourth crew this month. Oh my god! I have to say, <laughs> is in incredible shape. Do you think he's more cardio or weight focused? <laughs> it doesn't matter. He looks fantastic. Do you think the house is ever gonna get fixed? At <laughs> that rate, Knuckles is just having a little trouble adjusting to his new home. It wasn't easy for me to understand this planet at first either. When did you start getting so wise? <laughs> I learned a lot of cereal <laughs> Also, I had a family that was patient enough to things out. In the meantime, do you mind asking him to get our <laughs> dog off the roof? <laughs> Concentrate, Wolf. Aww. Wolf. Wolf. Anywhere at any time, you must have steely focus. Nice. Knuckles is a dog person. See? We be friends. Aww. Stelia. I mean, that definitely gives some points. <laughs> you know what? I think now is a good time for that talk. <laughs> Come on, Ozzy. Yeah. Good boy. Is she gonna fly is he gonna fly him down? Uh, uh don't they're not showing it. Off screen. Happened off screen. What? Really? You don't think Green Hills is a beautiful place to live? No. Not even a little? <laughs> no. Okay. I mean <laughs> look Does he think anything's oh, beautiful? Don't think <laughs> this is No. Okay, fine. We'll circle back to this later. <laughs> You know, Man. hedgehog to echidna. Perhaps you are right, hedgehog. Allow me to meditate on your words of wisdom. Perfect. <laughs> My work here is done. I'm going to do fun things. That's a good idea. Yes. Can I come? Sonic, take me with you. <laughs> I want to just cameo in the next Sonic show. Kids, so power him out. Hook a brother up. Yes. I found myself <laughs> at home. I was very specific. Whoa, food! Yes. Boys, breakfast is ready. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Castle Woman. 
Nice. Morning, Knuckles. <clears throat> is that an iron throne at our breakfast table? <laughs> yes. Nice. Morning, what is that? <laughs> it is merely the seat that designates my role as family champion. If you wish to take it, you must simply defeat me in a ritual battle or trial by combat. Wow. <laughs> what do you mean, trial by combat? <laughs> Come, Fox. I will show you. Oh, God. I don't think that was a challenge. And made myself at home. Oh, God. Oh. Aww. He has Aww. a little helmet. Ozzy. <laughs> we are not turning our living room into some kind of gladiator fighting pit. Warrior fighting pit. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> what is Ozzy doing here? Ozzy has bravely Aww. volunteered for the first match by challenging. Oh, he's so cute with the little helmet. What enemy? Oh boy. Uh, <laughs> is that <a> mailman? Please. <laughs> I just want to go home. <laughs> Grounded. I have no idea what that means. <laughs> you definitely do. It means no battling enemies. No leaving your room on quests. And most of all, no warrioring. How dare Oh you? no. Oh no. I swear you will regret Check the back. day you. Excuse me? You will regret the day you. <laughs> Word of advice Do not mess with Maddie when she's this mad. Very well, Pretzel Woman. <laughs> I will accept my grounding with honor. Nice. Wow. Oh, man. Show is wild Wait, already. I'm going to be late for work. Uh, Maddie, we may have another issue. Oh, it looks no. Like Knuckles built part of his throne out of. Our car. Oh, our car. I like the family stuff. Hey, this is Wade. I can't answer the phone right now. I'm training for the biggest tournament of my adult life. <laughs> After the beep. Beep. What tournament? I know, right? Oh. Uh, okay. I'm glad they answered that immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Wow. The renegades. Have you ever been bowling? Yes. Uh <laughs> Have I ever been bowling? Yes. You are pretty. Yet you That's are not pretty. right, though. Aww. But most of all, why are you seeing this mantra like just as you're about to you actually do it? <laughs> That's why. That's, I just oh. I hope she's there trolling him every Susie, time. I have begged you a thousand times. Please do not insult me in the middle of my backswing. Maybe <laughs> See? I wouldn't insult you if you weren't such a freaking loser. Well, maybe I would. Aww. Aww. Wait, get it together. The renegades need you. <laughs> <laughs> <Strike. laughs> this is wild. They're very serious about bowling. This is what the Swahili tribesmen call Kufafa Nuawakati. What? <laughs> what is happening? I am Wade Whipple, and I am an unstoppable warrior. I am Wade Whipple. I, am <laughs> I mean, if I had that name, I'd be so hyped. Wade Whipple? That's a that's a sick alliterative name. Alliteration <laughs> is fun. Again, doesn't it seem like we're going a bit far? <laughs> Not far enough. You can do this, Wade. I'm... <laughs> this is weird. What? Just who do you think you are? Oh, I'm so happy you asked. I'm an acclaimed writer of historical fiction. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Nice. I'm someone who uses his keen instincts to hunt the world's most dangerous animal. Man. What? <laughs> what? Bounty hunter. Oh, okay. That makes Sorry, sense. <laughs> He's like that with everybody. Very expository. Yes. <laughs> Squash her like a bug. Not literally. Yeah, and definitely don't crush your skull, please. Oh! Oh! oh no! We won! <laughs> wait, wait, let's wait, let's wait before we celebrate. We don't know if the pin's gonna drop yet. Uh, 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 this is this is tension <laughs> I didn't need right now. I mean, I feel like him doing that is cheating, if that actually helped. Oh, uh, no! I'm sorry, Jack. I failed you. No, you didn't fail me, Wade. You failed the renegades. Oh. oh. Warriors don't get mentally and emotionally decimated by young children. Oh. She is the soul of a very old witch of some kind. <laughs> the women know my team needs the strongest of warriors, and you, Wade Whipple, are not a warrior. You're off the team. Oh, no, no. Come Aww. on, Jack. Well, there's, there goes the premise of the show, I'm assuming. Time for the tournament. Little Susie. Whoa! She's a fearless stone cold killer on the lanes. I mean, she's that that actress is definitely not five. <laughs> <laughs> nice. 
fun and cool. Yeah, <laughs> it will be. Maybe I could go as an alternate. I'm afraid there's no room in the car for you, pal. No room in a stretch, Hummer? Because <laughs> that is theft, technically, but you can have it back. I'll give it to you. <laughs> she wears it well. Fits her like a glove. <laughs> I don't know why these jokes are sending me right now. <laughs> I lied to you about the stretch homer. We just don't want you. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> that would be hilarious. If the card actually did that. Oh my god. Hey, buddy. <laughs> How's it going? I took your advice, and now I lay banished on the floor of shame. With nothing to do but plot my revenge against you. Whoa. Oh. Oh. Big guy. Video games, they have come a long yeah. way since the 90s. <laughs> <laughs> I understood that reference. Oh, God. <laughs> man, me and Sonic would vibe, man. We would just vibe out. Yes, you guys would be biffles. We would be best friends. <sighs> the hedgehog could not possibly understand. I would do dance videos with Sonic. Aww. 100%. Are you Wait, Whoa, what? what? The Mets lost again. <laughs> <laughs> what the? It's me. Aww. Whoa. Chief Patrick Kamak? Put down the rubber chicken and give you all the... <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what? Uh, what? <laughs> Voiced by Christopher Lloyd. Ah. Uh, back to the future. I want you to train an apprentice in the ways of the echidna. Teach him our customs. Well, that's the premise of the series. <laughs> yeah. Once again. But where will I find such a student? Right here. Wait, <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Hot pockets. What? No great warrior. Neither were you when we first met. <laughs> this is like so specific. This is wild. <laughs> this is everything I love about the Sonic movies. The fate. What? Is in your <laughs> but wait, I thought he was what? able to go through things. <laughs> this is so inconsistent. <laughs> I don't care. I don't care. So is the implication that there's actual magic or that he just found it himself? Both. Oh, get a dynamite. Oh what God! <laughs> wow. <laughs> this is no time for lying down. <laughs> An urgent need. How did you get in here? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <I> <laughs> you seek to compete in the upcoming tournament of champions in Reno, Nevada. Until I lost my spot on the team. How? Mm. You were bested by a sworn enemy in trial by combat. I was brutally trash talked by an eight year old girl. Uh, <laughs> all right, that makes way more sense. Same thing. Same thing. But I am. I can train you in ways of the echidna. Yes. You every form of lethal combat. Secrets to all my strength. Nice. And I could use that to challenge Susie in a trial by bowling. So weird. I will make you a true warrior, as the great echidna chief Patrick Mack did for me. Patrick and Mac. I think my sister went to sleepaway camp there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> awaits Wade Whipple. Didn't I hear you were grounded? There's no way you're allowed to leave home, right? <laughs> well, ground an echidna warrior. Whoa. For an echidna warrior has no home. All right, that checks out. Let's do it. <laughs> Destiny awaits. <laughs> yeah, let's go. Oh, oh God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Why would he do that? <laughs> he knows he's a weakling. <laughs> Nug Nug, you gotta say who's there. Who's there? Knuckles Cage. <laughs> Please stop. <laughs> well, let's dig a little deeper, you know? You have any hobbies? Honor. <laughs> True. Mm, maybe I should state the question. What do you like to do for fun? Vengeance. <laughs> I'll put on one of my classic Wade mixes. Oh, God. Let's see. Let's what see. is it? Everyone at the station. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! Yeah. You want you want? I wonder if they're playing this because Paramount bought the rights for Mew Mayhem, oh. and they still had them. <laughs> yes, and they and they were just cheaper to use it again. Oh, that's horrible! <laughs> he kicked it. I love it. 
Oh no! What is happening now? Oh no! Well, well, well. Looks like we've got a runner. Oh! Gun! Very on the nose. Yes. Oh, Ma'am, you just took our sat surveillance offline. Oh! Kid Cuddy. Except for you. That device. Ah. Whoa, they have a Whoa. ring. Whoa! Whoa! What? That's cool. Thank you for your work, Agent Fairley. Oh no! Dismissed? What a dick move. Oh! <laughs> I don't what? know what is beautiful this time of year, my friend. Enjoy! Oh, what a dick. You should be proud of yourself for someone who just kicked an unsuspecting man in the chest. Yeah. <laughs> well, come on. We've got work to do. That was a bit much. Yeah. But okay. I'm pretty sure he would have been sworn to secrecy. Whoa, that's an interesting man for welding. What is it? They're disturbing my work. Ooh. It's the hound from Game of Thrones. Wanted you to be the first to know. One of the aliens has left Green Hills. He's in the wild. Well, that's Robotnik's tech. This one. Mm. Knuckles. Ah, the muscle. His powers are exceptional. Why do they need to wait for them to leave though? If they want to capture, I, I guess or they just... want to. I guess they want to pick them off one by one. Whoa! I've been scouring the world for these quills. They're the key to everything I'm building. You can build an even uh, petting zoo for all I care. <laughs> we'll meet our price. We'll bring you the echidna in 24 hours. Whoa! You'll need more than arrogance. I'm sending you something. Oh shit! To a lot of quills. Because anyone who goes against Knuckles better be ready for the fight of their lives. Oh, God. <laughs> That's a little on the nose? Uh, more than a little. Oh, food. <laughs> grapes. That's a horrible way to eat grapes. <laughs> Someone who doesn't use their individual fingers. <laughs> As the great Patrick Mac once said, you cannot train for battle without first knowing your battleground. That's good advice. That's really good advice, actually. Get ready to have your mind blown. <laughs> yeah. Knuckle his cage. <laughs> oh my god. This is my battleground. Whoa. This is Whoa. My place of battle. Maybe it is. Many a battle has been won and lost between these very lanes. Plus, bowling is a beautiful game. Aww. He's passionate. <laughs> what the heck is the soundtrack? It's wild. Someone, they spent a lot of money on music. Or maybe they didn't. Maybe Paramount has a good deal. <laughs> Wait, that's archery. No. Just, it's just like, he's just flexing. He's just in the zone. See, my dad taught me everything I know about bowling. He taught me how to get the perfect spin on my shot. Taught me how to nail a 7-10 split. Tell me which Impressive. buffalo wings would give me indigestion and fill me with regret in the morning. <laughs> the what happened to him? TJ Maxx. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? 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 Awesome name indeed. <laughs> it's really it's not. Tour. Sometimes, when I'm between those lanes, it's like we're together again. Dude, what? That's Playing so depressing. This yeah. is dark. So bowling is the thing that makes you feel at home in this world? Yeah. I guess it is. Oh, we got here just in time. It glows with the power of a falling Galactus star. I actually think it's glowing with the power from the laundromat next door. <laughs> <laughs> Feel its power course through your ginormous hand. <laughs> Take aim at your pins and... Oh, God! <laughs> That's not a flex. He just caused property damage. <laughs> He shattered the pins. What? <gasps> How, where did they get all these rings from? Well, it could be the same ring. But they're only one use, aren't they? I don't remember. Sorry, this lane is reserved. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is because Knuckles is grounded, right? Uh, <laughs> Dude, yeah. what? Does it matter? Oh, God. Oh! That's a lot of collateral damage. Uh, just a little bit. <laughs> You're coming with us. You think you can take my power? Oh! Oh! 
Whoa. Oh, God. Do I look like I need your power? Whoa. What are you talking about? Oh. Throwback. <laughs> <laughs> Sell it for lots and lots. I know that. I was just trying to have a cool catchphrase moment until you. Oh! <laughs> Ow! Yeah! Hunter of Need. Hunter somewhere. No! Ow! Oh! oh that hurt! Strike! <laughs> yeah, you said the thing that he said. Whoa, that okay, that was cool. I believe in knuckles. I mean, better. Oh no! Ow. Right in his spine. <coughs> I've called him that. He doesn't like it. Respect his preference. Yes. Only his friends can call him that, like me. Oh shit, that was cool. Oh, yeah. Oh, no, Ooh. not the turtles. No. Was that turtles in time? It is some version of turtles. All right. What? Oh, they have guns that can shoot rings? <gasps> oh, what? No! Which created a distraction, <laughs> which resulted in a diversion, which, all right, let's call it a team effort. <laughs> oh, my God. You guys are the worst. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. They have knuckles. It's all my fault. I mean, it really he isn't. To help him. I eh, he didn't really help much. I mean, he didn't help, definitely. Oh. You have an incredibly dumb idea. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Oh, no, you can't end it like that. <laughs> yeah, but they have to have the rest of the show. I know, you're right. I forgot, uh, this is only episode one. Oh, the hat. This is cute, though. I like this. This is a fun ending. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, this is such a banger of a soundtrack. This is a real, but this is a banger. Yeah. Aww. <laughs> Yo, Wade, what up, Knuckles? <laughs> oh, nice. the Sonic Band! Team Sonic. The Mario. I love it. More uh, Knuckles. More Knuckles, please. Can all I right. have more Knuckles, please? We gotta talk about this. Uh, this show. Like, listen. The Sonic movies are memes. They're fantastic movies, but they do not take themselves too seriously at all. And that's the thing I love most about the Sonic movies. They're not afraid to take the piss out of themselves a little bit <laughs> in their jokes and be meme movies. And that's like my peak love yes. of this franchise. So to see this series give deliver on everything I love about those movies, <laughs> while also giving a pretty compelling story yes. between the two leads, I'm super impressed. Wait, who are the two leads? Two leads are obviously Knuckles and Wade. Oh, this show. I thought you meant the... F no, the movie, I meant sorry. the show. I meant the show. I think... First of all, I think the pairing of Knuckles and Wade is a fantastic choice. Yes. Because they are the polar opposites of each other. They are definitely each other's relief. Yes. In the sense of too much Knuckles is a bad thing because he's very... <laughs> like, he is very self-serious. He's yes. very on the nose. Everything is matter of fact. I, I need to say this because it's so wild say to me. It. Between the two movies and just even this episode, and I'm assuming the rest of the show, how insanely consistent the tone and the writing have been. Because it's more... Yes. It's goofy. It's... I, I'm trying to think of the way to describe it, but it's so unique to itself. Yes. And it somehow has maintained that. And I think that's kind of an achievement in itself. Everything feels like a singular unit. Everything feels like it has the same voice. I think a large part of that is how heavily involved Jeff Fowler is yes. in the series. Obviously, oh. main part of the show. Mm -hmm. um, and it's his vision through the past three movies. Mm -hmm. I love that. And I love how this is like an echo, <laughs> uh, a mirror image of Sonic 1. Yeah. How we developed Sonic through his relationship with Tom, the mm -hmm. Donut Lord. Uh, and their buddy cop road trip movie. Yeah. Whereas now we have that with Wade and Knuckles. Mm -hmm. And I think whereas Tom was the perfect pairing for Sonic because Sonic was very immature mm -hmm. and Tom was very uh, mature and he was all about responsibility and taking things seriously. So they, they really bonded with each other. Mm -hmm. I think this is a really great opportunity for Knuckles to grow. It really is. And also, like, I'm glad you mentioned Wade. And the thing that, like, I thought was so silly was people making jokes about how Oh, guys, all your favorite Sonic characters are in this show, except not really. They're just random humans. And part of me feels like, did you not watch the movies? Yeah. Like, yes, it's 
I remember when the first song came out, it was weird because it was really only Sonic and Robotnik and we don't have the whole expanded universe. But one, that's been consistent this whole time. Yep. And two, I think that it works for this very specific vision. Yes, absolutely. I think... It, it, see, the pro- the biggest problem, I think, with that, like, oh, man, we need to have all the Sonic characters from the games and stuff. Yeah, I would love that. But mm-hmm. also, what I think this show has to do is it has to develop Knuckles as a character first. Yeah. Like, yeah, if this show does well, hopefully we get a Knuckles season two and we can get very lore heavy. But... Knuckles' this biggest problem in Sonic 2 is mm-hmm. we ended that movie where he wasn't fully developed as a character. We knew yes. him. We got most of the movie he was an antagonist mm-hmm. uh, with Robotnik. And then at the end, he became a protagonist. And we get that little ending scene of them playing baseball, which is cute. But I, I that's some my one of my complaints of Sonic 2 is we needed to develop Knuckles more. Not that it yeah. is a complaint. I knew that I was hoping in Sonic 3 would happen. But the fact that he's getting his own series to do it, I think, was smart. So we could focus on Shadow mm-hmm. and his background in Sonic 3. Mm-hmm. And this will give us an opportunity to flush out Knuckles more and show his role in that, uh, that unit. Yeah, absolutely. Because I think the way he was written in the second movie was incredibly specific yeah. with the knowledge of the stuff that was going to be oncoming. Because, yeah, I mean, from a character's perspective, I think... He was very one note. Yeah. And I... And I... We got to... T- Sonic 2 was Tails' movie. It was Tails' movie. And I was just going to say also, some stuff was a bit cringe at times. Uh, but for in, in, intentionally, though. Yeah, I mean, uh, I I know I know that you got a little tired of Knuckles' shtick um, yeah. at, in Sonic 2. I, I was just like, you know what? It's all part of the fun for me. But I wanted more... After Knuckles switched sides, mm-hmm. I wanted to know more. I wanted to see Knuckles function in that that trio. Yes, and I think this, like, even just this one episode has already given him even more to work with. Yes, absolutely. We learn, like, we learn a little bit more about him. We learn his mission in life. We learn uh, more about the echidnas. Be it not too much, but just <laughs> enough to kind of get the series going. We kind of see him function as part of that uh, trio of characters, yeah. Team Sonic, if you will. So I really love that. And, and, and this series is doing everything I hoped it would in terms of, you know, really branching out the character of Knuckles and giving him his own adventure and fleshing him out because that's what I really want to see. I want to see Knuckles. Yes. And I honestly, really love Wade as a character. Oh my gosh. He's so silly. He's so innocent. Like, they, they joke <laughs> him up. They make him really hammy and stupid and, and buffoonish for most of the episode. And then that moment with him talking about his dad... Yes. You really you really understand why people not believing in him mm-hmm. cuts him so deep. Yeah. Because his father, he feels like his father abandoned him and didn't believe in him. Mm-hmm. So it hurts. And t- that's why I love the Sonic movies. Because again, they don't take <laughs> themselves seriously. But they have these moments of pathos and really strong character development yeah. that come out of nowhere. And it just hits you right in the face. Well, they need to have that to undercut, like, the stoop... Like, I don't want to call it the stupidity. The st- the silliness at times. I mean, even the yeah. first movie, kind of off the bat, without... Like, it, the movie happened because Sonic was lonely. Yeah. And he was kind of grieving his how things used to be for him. Yeah, he, he, was, he was a kid who was abandoned. Not uh, not abandoned. He was a kid who was sent to a foreign planet. Yeah, because his, men- his parental figure was killed. Yeah. And, and it's really hard. Like, again, all of these characters have really heartbreaking stories. Even Tails, to a certain extent, was lonely. Yeah. And then he came to Earth, and he found a best buddy in Sonic, and, and Tom and Maddie. And I love how he's just, like, the responsible one. Yes. He's like, uh, Maddie, your car. Like, <laughs> and, and in my head, I'm like, he's going to fix the car. For yeah. Because that's what he does. Yeah, it still sucks for <laughs> It does. But, man, I'm just loving this show so far. Cannot wait to dive into this. So good to be back. I miss yeah. Sonic. I've missed the Sonic universe. I know. It's one of my favorite franchises at the moment. Yes, and you have so much more to come now. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. We are back. If you guys like this video, make sure to give it a huge thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, subscribe to the notification bell to stay up to date on all our latest content. If you want to check out our other Knuckle reactions, click the link on the page. Until next time, guys, stay versed.